Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Unlock the full potential of your sales outreach by integrating Apollo with LinkedIn in 2023. This tutorial walks you through the process ensuring a smooth connection between Apollo and LinkedIn for enhanced prospecting and relationship building. So guys, let's get started. Before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. So the first thing guys to do is to head up to Apollo.io and click on the first link. Then here you should simply create a new account or sign into your account. So I'm going to do that real quick, sign up for free. And here you should just search to sign in using your email or, or like your Gmail account or your Microsoft account. So here as an example, I will do that, sign up with Google and then I will choose my first account and I will be logged into the Apollo platform. Uh, it's right as you can see here. So welcome Apollo, we'll switch a little bit and there we have the account. So now we have to set up for success so here you should simply complete this guide you can either choose to complete it or skip it and do it later and then you have it like that so let's go here we go let's wait a little bit until it works it might be a little bit laggy and there we have it so now i can quit it and here it is the page so now how can i integrate anything with apollo itself well if you want here as you can see there is the settings and in here into the settings you should be able to find here anything that has anything with integrations don't worry guys if you didn't find it you just have to go to configuration and search for it you might miss it so that's why we use um like this one so we can use uh, control and F and it will help you to search for a specific word so here we want integration and as you can see here it is so after clicking on it here it is integrations and we have selected it successfully now we want to connect it to LinkedIn but as you can see here LinkedIn isn't one of the apps that we can connect uh, Apollo into it there is Slack there is like a bunch of options Zapier API single sign on and others so it is it is not a problem for us since we are going to use Zapier as our like here it is it will it will expand itself. Avoid repetitive tasks and create automation between Apollo and over 2000 web apps. So basically it will help us integrate Zapier with Apollo and Apollo with LinkedIn eventually using Zapier. So let's click here to connect. Let's click here to get started and you will be taken to Zapier. In Zapier here you should click on apps and after that you should simply head up to the app section search for the convenient app for you in our case it's going to be apollo and here you should find it click on connect and then you should be ready to go so here we should finish these two so i'm going to click here to get the code and it should be somewhere around here which code do we need we need the api key so we need one of these okay let's get it so search API, uh, keep your records clean up to date, which is to over 20. Okay, let's get started with this one, for example, and the same thing for this one. So here they go. And now here you will have a bunch of options, bunch of things. So how to get rid of the uh, API code. So all you need to do is to go to the settings and click on integrations, but we're not going to do that. We're just going to go to API keys, click here and key name let's give it like for example uh, Zapier and let's choose select an API to associate with this key we don't really need or we can use this one for example okay let's choose this one and let's use it like that and create API key and there we have it so now we can copy it paste it here name it as an example Apollo and this continue to Apollo and then we just have to wait and the account should be created and connected successfully now go here to the three points this connection and it has been done successfully as well the same thing has to be done with LinkedIn so you just have to create an account if you don't have it already and if you have it just search for it and connect it with um, with the Zapier app so connect and we just have to do the same thing connect sign in 
and connect it to your account which is basically the same step that i have shown you uh here it is this is the, the connection i can remove this one for now and here it is the, we can test it again and as you can see it has been tested successfully now let's create a zap so let's create a zap that has will be connecting apollo and zap and linkedin so basically i would sell it whatever or whenever something happens on apollo make something in link the end and look at it so let's generate and basically here we are going to write a prompt it can be literally any prompt you have in mind so share apple activity on linkedin so new contacts get share update for example i add a new contact it will share on linkedin that i have created a new contact with the name x as an example so now all you need to do is to try it if you liked it and then you should create and log in to your account so choose this account as you can see continue uh, if there is any triggers that has to be done, it's, you, you can do it, or else you can just uh, not do it. For me, for me, it was enabled to pull contact, so I don't have any contacts for now. So what you should do is to create a new contact on your Apollo account. So uh, basically, it's gonna be very easy. You don't really have to do it, but uh, yeah, it's uh, important. Not really that important, but it can help you a lot uh, through. To make sure that your account has been made successfully and correctly but for now you can just test uh, like skip the test so let's wait a little bit skip test and it will give you like it has been done successfully as you can see the same thing goes for the linkedin as you can see test i'm going to skip the test and it will be able to publish it as you can see here and now this app has been made and the tasks will be created uh, without any problems everything will be working successfully for us as you can see so basically guys this is how you can make an integration between apollo or uh, linkedin bit together and make sure also guys that you have enough zaps in your account so once you open your account here in the bottom left you'll find free plan and here we'll find how many tasks and zaps you have so make sure to get the uh, total amount of tasks that you own for example for me i have only 100 you can upgrade it if you want to go for the premium plan and you will only have five zaps so make sure to consider them because once you have reached the limit you will not be able to make any integration anymore and these are the plans that you have here so you can add a limit limited amount of zaps with a limited amount of tasks if you want to there is up to 2 million tasks if you would like to have them but of course it will cost you a lot of money so put that in mind and yeah that was basically it i hope you guys like this video if you do have any more questions make sure to leave them down below in the comment section and thank you guys for watching see you guys in the next tutorial